Young intersections bridging the space involved girls from four distinct cultural backgrounds who worked together to create artwork that reflected their own cultures. The exhibition that resulted was a celebration of cultural and religious diversity that is so much the cornerstone for a healthy multicultural Australian society. I was a little uneasy about how our religions would work. Would we, like, would we get into arguments or you know, religious discussions? But after the first time meeting everyone, it was kind of clear that we're here to work together, but not to blend our religions at all. Like, we didn't have to give anything. We didn't have to give our religion up or anything like that. We could celebrate our uniqueness. So that was really nice to see. I got really excited like to work with different schools and different cultures, and especially with my friends like doing art and like outside of school. It's kind of cool to miss classes as well and stuff. It was fantastic actually because it was really good that um, we were getting involved with other schools but um, also other religions and it was just an experience to learn about their culture and them to see what we've done. Um, well I had the idea of using spray cans, spray paint because I thought I'd give it like teenage looks so it's appealing to today's society as well not using like olden day stuff and like so when we had young people, teenagers, like see in streets and alleyways how cool they look, we tried to use them and see how they work. And it was good because it was fast and like it's good to work with. This is pretty good because we get to use our brains and we actually get to learn also about our cultures and um, people find out, you know, what they didn't know before about um, their tribe and their totems and all that sort of stuff. I just walked in here this morning, I was like, wow, it just looks stunning, it's fantastic, so creative, just the ideas are just fantastic, it's going to look great. We have the Murray River, um, which is flowing from the wall to the ground, it's based as on the waterfall and it's flowing on the ground, with our totems um, pegged onto the waterfall and also um, just been put on the ground, flowing through the um, Murray River. Um, well, after sticking with religion and culture, we wanted a piece from us, like we could like squirrels, love hearts, smiley faces and like we had our names in cool writing on the bottom to like represent uh, this is our work but also another piece that is like something from us. So it was really cool. It was amazing to see that with the same tasks, the same um, guidelines, we all came up with different ways of looking at our religions and that just goes to show that our religions are so different. But um, they mean so much to us in different ways and different ways of approaching our religions according to culture.
Oh, I'm really excited. Like everyone's stuff looks really, really awesome and stuff. And um, like just to see what they've come up with, like that's really special to them, is like it's really cool. I really enjoyed it. Like I learned a lot about everyone's culture and what's different to ours. Like what they have to eat or like different holidays they celebrate that I didn't really know about before. So that was really good. Yeah. So it's sort of dictated to us by society like you know you can't be friends with them because you're from different religions but um, in a way it was just nice to see that through our artwork we became really like we became friends and, and we know so much about each other now and our religions and cultures. It was nice.